As you know, uh, if you've been in New York or even on the East Coast at all in the last couple of weeks, deep freeze here in this part of the country. It has been bitterly cold outside. And I learned just a couple of days ago that fans of our show who don't have regular tickets, who are hoping to get standby tickets, have to show up really early in the morning and wait outside Rockefeller Center. They don't even let these people wait inside. They have to wait outside. And when I heard about this, I was like, that, that's insane. It is really cold out there. So I decided I have to do something about it. And I, uh, I took a camera crew with me, and this is what happened. Old timers are calling this the coldest winter ever in New York. No one's ever seen a winter like this. It's bitter, bitter cold outside. And uh, I found out just the other day that uh, fans of mine that are waiting in the standby ticket line to see my show have to show up here at 8 o'clock in the morning and wait in the bitter, bitter cold outside. It's amazing. I felt terrible about this. I, I love my fans. I cherish them. So I, um, I decided to do something about it. I rented a, an amazing Winnebago. You can see this thing is gorgeous. It's a beautiful piece of machinery. Got a nice driver up there. What's your name, sir? Greg. Okay, don't talk to me and drive at the same time. <laughs> Keep your eyes on the road! <laughs> anyway, we're going to drive over uh, and pick up some uh, of these fans. They don't know it, and we're going to bring them into this nice warm Winnebago and put on a little show for them. Hello. How are you? Is everybody uh, nice and warm? Yeah. You guys all right? How long have you been in this line? An hour. Do you think it's insane that you guys have to wait outside for standby tickets? Yes. yes. To a show hosted by a drunk? I can only take some of you. There's not enough room for everybody. But we're going to take a little trip in the nice warm Winnebago. Again, I repeat, I can't take all of you. Most of you are going to have to die. Come on in. No pushing, please. Everyone in. Let's try and squeeze together. There's not a lot of room. Take a minute to turn to the person next to you and introduce yourself. Just make sure you two should talk to each other. Uh, you should talk to her. Uh, everybody meet each other. Um, okay, the door isn't... Are we allowed to drive legally if the door is... Son of a bitch! Oh, God! Huh? What did you say to me? Locked. That's why you're having a hard time closing it. It's locked. That's why you're having a hard time closing it. You don't want this job, do you? You want me to... I was everybody else. Never I was makes me look bad in front of the audience. Do you understand that? That's right. The audience needs to think I'm a golden god. Oh. And when you're here telling me how to lock or unlock a door... What? Are you talking about something? You mean you are? What's that? You mean you aren't a golden god? Okay, this you guy, mean... I swear to you, you're going to have to go. I, we're going to have... You're so close to being... There's actually an ejector seat in this thing. You're so close to being tossed. Who's single here? I'm just curious. Really? Anybody else? You? You seem frightened. You seem like you didn't want to admit you were single. As if a big six-foot-four pervert was standing over you. That's not funny. And you? What's your story? I think I'm single. Mm -hmm. Well, sorry, ladies. <laughs> ding, ding. <laughs> It comes off as easy as it goes on, you know what I'm saying? What did you say? I am not gay. Is that what you said? I thought you said I was gay. Okay. So let's have a hand for our band leader, uh, Max Weinberg. He's here. Whenever you're ready, Max. And now, here's your host. Oh, none of Friday! Yeah! City of New York has agreed to uh, let the artist Christo drape 23 miles of orange colored fabric around Central Park. Did you hear about that? Can you flip them a little faster? Okay. Okay. Uh, they had 23 miles of fabric around the park. Yeah, coincidentally, this is the same amount of fabric he used to make a tank top for Anna Nicole Smith. <laughs> <laughs> Last night on American Idol, uh, controversial judge Simon Cowell called Christina Aguilera a slut. Huh? Oh. Yeah. After hearing this, a furious Aguilera said, that's insulting. I go by sleazy ho now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Hey, folks, it's time now for a bit you all love called If They Made It, huh? Is it Say Who's Who here? I don't know who these people are. <laughs> Mariah Carey and Vin Diesel are supposedly went on a date. You guys want to know what their baby would look like? Sure. All right, look at that. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. oh my God. Look at that. It's their two faces smushed together. <laughs> you know? Two faces. Can you, can you see? You like this one? Yeah. Was that, that did you think it was funny? Pretty strange looking, I think. Your names. Your name is Amy and Rob. Amy and Rob. Hold that. Amy and Rob have been in the news lately dating. That's Amy, right there, and Rob. Mm -hmm. Aren't you guys wondering what would happen if these two made it? Yeah. yeah. yeah all right. Okay, so let's start a commercial right now. All right, folks, we got a big celebrity guest coming up in a second on the Winnebago. Tired of painful rectal itch? I think I can help. Hi, I'm Angela Lansbury. If you're like me, sitting, well, is pure hell. That's why I've come up with a new cream that relieves tension and swelling. All right, everybody, we're back, and we're on our way to get the uh, celebrity guest. Let's go find the celebrity guest. Woo! 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 99 bottles of beer. You take one down, pass it around. 98 bottles of beer. No, 90, it goes to 98. Hold it, hold it, hold it. It drops down a beer bottle every time. You're gonna stay at 99. This is gonna be a pretty long trip. <laughs> okay, I get these headaches. No one panic. Who just hit my ass? Did you, did you just touch my ass? Ladies and gentlemen, it's hammer time! MC Hammer, everybody! Hey! How are ya? Thank you so much for being here! MC Hammer! My man, my man! Crank that radio. Yeah, yeah, turn, turn that up. Turn that up. No, turn that up. Long, loud, loud. Yeah, we can work that out. Hey, watch this. Here's the part where it changes. Where we go? <laughs> you go low and I go high, man. <laughs> What's the next suit for? For joining us. All right, we'll take a little break. When we come back, Heather Graham. Is going to be with us.